Let me show you how I used my dermacid beetle colony to clean this corn snake's skeleton. After this snake passed away from natural causes, the owner gave it to me for preparation. After removing the skin and all the internal organs, I left it out to dry in the Texas summer heat for a day. This dehydrated the specimen in the exact position I wanted it to be cleaned in, so that I would not have to reposition and rearticulate it afterwards. Then, I fed it to my beetles, which cleaned it in about a day and a half during this time lapse. I find snake anatomy extremely interesting. Most of their body consists of their spine and ribs, but you can see the exact position where the ribs stop and the tail starts. You can really appreciate the similarities to other reptiles here. Unlike most lizards, however, their jaws are not fused and instead held together by a very elastic ligament, which allows their mouths to expand when swallowing prey whole. And here is the finished product before I put it in a shadow box and send it on its way home. Although some might find it weird to have their pet on display, I find it to be a very beautiful memorial.